So we're in Del Monte Apartments. Yeah, the Del Monte Alley right here. A lot of don't happen right here, cuz. A lot of can't even speak on. It get real tricky around this like Mickey dead homies, nigga. Stop playing. Yeah, what's been going on? Even not to be farm ghetto, like, bro, like, <laughs> I don't know what you say. Winter Park Mall, cuz we fight every weekend, nigga. Quick in the friendly. <laughs> quick friendly. Yeah, the West Side don't money block. West Side don't money. <laughs> we hella outnumbered though. Yeah, not that many blacks in this county. The yeah, op came up to me, opened my car door. <laughs> I took off of that. I whooped the <laughs> out that. Next thing you know, any moment is go time for real. Oh shit. Pussies, pussies, the PCs. But no good. <laughs> okay. Them light, you know, know. Light. to be continued on the set. On the set, cuz. Be my nigga on the set, cuz. West Side. Yeah. On the set, cuz. Free me too. I'm on a run. Moving crib. West Side. Valley Club. The Cult. Valley Club. Say, baby, now I know you're probably wondering, like, Big Cactus, what in the f are you doing in Anaheim, California? Like, did you just want to take a little vacation to Disneyland? After that, maybe slide over to Knott's Berry Farm and ride some roller coasters? And the answer to both questions is no. A few weeks ago, while scrolling on IG, I seen the homie Upgood share a video he shot for K4, aka the finesse kid called Party Full of Cribs. I saw K4 was from Anaheim and thought, holy sh Anaheim has cribs there? It turns out they do, and they reside in the heart of the west side, on Del Monte Block, a block known for being the only black set in Anaheim surrounded by rival Latino sections on every single side of them. Like most of you at home, when I think Anaheim, I think Disneyland, aka the most magical place in the world. But lo and behold, there is indeed a flip side to this section of Orange County. So I got in touch with K4, aka the Finesse Kid, and he agreed to show us around so that y'all could see this flip side to the most magical place on the planet. So come with me, the biggest cactus of all time, we cruise through the west side of Anaheim, California, home of the Del Monte Gangster Crips. We got the Astro Smoke Shop, lady, the Hood Smoke Shop. Everybody from Anaheim probably go here. You feel me? So like, when we tap in with the Astro Smoke Shop, come here. You be respectful and some more. The mold over here owning some more. Uh, tell them that K4 sent you. you know I mean, that's what niggas know me by. Set. Oh, just some fucking good times, you know. We use the struggle woods on the set. <laughs> set the struggle woods, guys. Uh, we we smoking the gas though. All we really waiting on is the homies. Had to stop here, had to grab some masks. Though. Set though. The hood smoke shop. I mean, that's the China key right there, bro. I remember one day I was with my ex girlfriend, right? A fork, a fork, an op. The op came up to me, opened my car door. I took off of that and I whooped the out of that. Next thing you know, this comes back over here with his fork homies and I'm about, come back, come back. Oh, face ass boy, guys. <laughs> what is a fork? A folk, Fun Anaheim folk. folks gang. Yeah, next week though. Okay, that's a whole different situation. He's right across the street though. Okay, that yeah. So, any moment is go time for real. Oh, shit. Where are we headed? I'll go down here. Yeah. <laughs> I grew up right here. This is why I was in. Where are we at? Yeah, this is not, not just where I grew up back oh. though. I moved here when I was like, what, 15, 14? Okay. Yeah, like, that's how, that's how, like, that's how, like, I really got introduced to the hood, because I used to be getting kicked out every night. Like, and it's sad. Uh, it used to be called, what the fuck that shit be called? Like, I forgot what it was called, the Lincoln Inn or some shit like that. And I used to go to school right here. Okay. School, we have Western's High School. We took right here. I never went to school, though. That's why I used to get kicked out all the time. So we be smoking weed instead of going to school and shit. Mom be tripping. We're in the west side of Anaheim. Side Not of none of that Disneyland, Mickey Mouse bullshit because we can take you on that side. Nothing like this side on the you, set. You know what the comments can <laughs> say. The, the comments say always gonna say that. Dead ass, but nigga, it get real tricky around this <laughs> like Mickey, dead homies, nigga. Stop playing. Stop playing, dude. So we're in Del Monte Apartments? Yeah, the Del Monte Alley right here. A lot of shit happen right here because a lot of can't even speak on. It was like three years ago. Three years ago, she got ass whooped. She'll probably get an ass whooped today. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody chased you with a crowbar, you said? Yeah. So, some that went to Western High School right here. Yeah. Talking about my name. One of my homies talking about, oh, that 
actually when I see her, I'm gonna stab this. I'm like, say less. I know where she goes to school at. So just one day, I just pull up with my homegirl. We're literally right here. I was posted in the cut. I just, I was just at one part of mine too. I came up on some white night for thirty. Clean, you know what I mean? So I'm waiting right there. I'm like, she's coming. I take off my shoes real quick. Walk up to the. I'm like, she was talking about my name or what? She's like, uh, I'm like, do you remember? She's like, uh, I'm like, you know who. I need your ones. I like, let's run the bait. Yeah. Boom, run up on the <laughs> Beat that <laughs> ass. My homegirl gets in. Start stopping the <laughs> out. Next thing you know, her brother comes out the apartment. He's like, what the <laughs> Get the <laughs> off my sister with this big ass crowbar. I'm like, oh, sh let's go. So we start dipping. And niggas chasing us with the crowbar all the way down the, the little, this little cut. Is it right here on the other side? Yeah, that's right. He can take right here, right? Yeah. They actually chased us all the way around the whole block. You know those apartments you said you lived at? Yeah. We got chased those apartment. We're like upstairs, we're like, we hear the like, where you is at? I'm a get, she has the crowbar at that point. Like, she's looking for us and shit. I'm like, out of breath and shit, hiding. I'm like, that, just dip out. Crucial. We're gone. Crucial. You were raised over here till you went to this high school? I didn't go to this high school, but I was raised on the west side of Atlanta. I was like thugging when I was like 15. I was like 18. Nah, you know where I was living? On Savannah Street. Oh, see. Yep. Man, I cause I know them. Like yes. you know who Miner is? Cousins is from Watergate, which we don't get along with that hood. Okay. So, Domani is the same. Yeah, the West Side Domani block. West Side Domani. <laughs> <laughs> so this on West Side Domani. That's it. Yeah, we, well, this is the Trey Forest right here. We got like we got two different sections. Okay, Trey Forest, Domani. Trey Forest and Trey One is all the same thing though, Domani. We hella outnumbered though. before they take me. Just keep putting out a bunch of music. Yeah, that's all I've been doing right now. I got a couple music videos coming out this month too. Uh, he's gonna go up for real. I see <laughs> it, I see it. He's gonna go up. He's going up. Uh, yeah, he's going up. There's not too many Anaheim rappers. That's the there ain't. Part. That's why I had to reach especially out. On especially that go hard. That's why I was like, I know that's yeah. a story that most people want to hear. Good Anaheim rappers. About Anaheim rap, some Anaheim yeah. hush. Yeah. You don't ever hear about that. My nigga, my nigga TG. That nigga's from the set. Yeah, uh, I think it kind of like how I said, like influenced me to like start some gangster rap. I always rap about gangster. Like some yeah, like some shit like that. Cause tech. that's what the song you sent me kind of reminded me of. Like yeah, modern day G funk. Yeah, like 
shit, man. Yeah, that's just tight. Everybody wanna be my friend now. Literally that nigga, that nigga, Ooh. that nigga West, that nigga, that nigga West you was talking to, that oh, nigga. Yeah, he wouldn't talk to you back then. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, <laughs> nigga, that's crazy too. That nigga wanna be from the sense yeah. the most yeah. now, cuz. Like like Definitely just a black set, but we got Hispanics, white people in the set. Like my little brother K5, that one know you that the one you just uh, see me with right now when he picked us up. That's my little brother, he's from the set too. That's why his name is K5. I'm K4. Okay, babe, so as we were waiting for some of the homies to trickle in and whatnot, we started linking up and getting set up to shoot a few scenes for the Bounce Out music video, which you can find in the description below, so go ahead and click that and check that out after you finish this vlog. So you can get a feel for the sound coming out of the Anaheim Del Monte area. I swear to God, they just act hard. I was kicking those, I was running to their backyard. I was chasing show, I ain't never had no late start. Dead homies, niggas lame as fuck, OP. I can suck a nigga out where I'm OT. Cool. I really hey. broke my phone right now. Okay, okay. I was gonna run you another seven. Okay, I broke my phone. That's my goal. Let's make it happen. Call me up, walk far, bitch. I'm a block star, nigga. When they got, they just act hard. Who knows? I was running to the backyard. I was chasing Joe. I ain't never had no late start, dead homies. Lucky for me, right? Lucky for me. He can just put it on again. I ain't sure, girl. Oh, big killer said, nah. Big killer said, nigga, run shit, girl. Oh, hey, you know that nigga call me? We sure. He said he's gonna give me, give me a little, little, little. But he wants to give seven, seven dollars after I sell it. Nah. Yeah, we still on the west side, cuz we out here at the homie smoke shop and I mean the homie liquor store. This is what we be hanging out and shit. This is where we be doing the put ons and shit. All the older homies be grouping up right here. Right. They put ons, cuz. Give them a little PTSD story or something, cuz. Okay. They said PTSD. <laughs> 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 what is Yeah, the homies, all the, all, the, all the older homies be popping out right here, cuz. So we gotta be getting in. Uh, still all west. Yeah, homies. They're not here, they ain't getting put up good. Okay, babe, and once we got to the last spot, the homies liquor store, we shot a couple more scenes for the bounce out music video before we got ready to wrap up part one of the West Side Anaheim tour. Something light, you know, to be continued on the set. On the set, cuz. Oh, crazy. It's just the beginning. Oh, shit. Getting the friendly. Quick friendly. Oh, oh, little friendly. Got the friendly. Guillotine. Take down defense is good. Take down defense is good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh Oh shit! 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 Oh my nigga in the sack, uh, West Side. Yeah, homies, yeah. yeah, free all the homies, cuz, in the sack, uh, free me too. I'm on a run, moving crib, West Side. Now, unfortunately, the homie K4, the finesse kid, did indeed get caught up and put in jail before we got to release this. 
before we got to finish part two of the Anaheim tour. So while the homie's locked up for hopefully not too long, go ahead, click all the music video links in the description below, follow him on IG, and wish him a speedy return home so we can give y'all part two of the Anaheim tour. Appreciate y'all for watching. As always, babe, it's me, the biggest cactus of all time. Love y'all. Valley Club, the cult. Valley Club, the cult.